So, we're going to very quickly <clears throat> at least take a look at MC Nemesis's channel. Oh, big boy subscribed. <laughs> what are these fucking views, bro? What are your views? <laughs> I get more views on my fucking streams. What's up guys? Hope we're having a great day today. Just vibing out. And well, today, well, today's video is going to be a little unusual. Obviously, I usually respond to other videos or at least some kind of quote unquote take, but this video is a little weird and it isn't a response. I'm also unsure of how long it'll turn out either. However, I intend for this to be on the shorter side. So today I'll be covering my personal interactions with a certain individual who came into my stream, the subsequent drama that followed that, and the rabbit hole it led me and my Discord server down shortly thereafter. I mostly intend for this video to be a quick summary of my interaction with this person, plus a bit of context on the individual in question, that being MC Nemesis. Because trust me, he may not seem like much at first, but you'll quickly come to find that he is an interesting specimen, to say the least. So I think I've rambled enough and hopefully warmed everyone up to the topic, so without any further delay, let's jump right into this by first starting with my initial interaction on my own live stream with MC Nemesis. Thank you for the dislike, MC Nemesis. <laughs> Did I get it? Nice, thanks. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> What's this bullshit channel about? I dislike me. Again, I don't give a fuck if you dislike my channel. I do commentary response stuff and I'm covering my lol cow bitch, so. Eh. <laughs> I'm flagging this shit? Cool. Have fun. So it all started with my most recent stream. I was live covering some recent Discord drama surrounding another idiot, which it's already a long story. He's not really important in context with the rest of this topic, but I'm just elaborating on what we were even doing at the time. Because this was just supposed to be a fun little stream, mostly for me and my group of friends, covering a drama horror which a lot of us have had reoccurring issues with over the past year. It was during this stream, while I had Brother Nier on with me as well, when this specimen decided to join. If I were trolling, you'd know it? Okay. Yeah, and we know it, we do, thank you, Nier. <laughs> <laughs> it's not hard to tell, you fucking retards. Because the stream is trash, then leave. Don't, Don't say the R word, it's offensive to some. Retard, retard, retard. <laughs> Cope, seethe, mauled, dilate. <laughs> I don't give a shit what you find offensive. Click off my YouTube channel if you think it's offensive. This is not my problem. To summarize what happened here, this man named MC Nemesis on YouTube joined my stream chat and immediately started talking shit. First by ridiculing what my stream is about and saying he was leaving a dislike, then further trying to antagonize Nier and I by claiming he would quote unquote flag the video, which I also find funny because it was a stream, not a video. But I brushed off his comment about flagging the stream and this guy, ugh, he further proceeds to antagonize me and the entire stream to little avail, because at the time, we all thought he was just a bad troll, and it was kind of funny. He was criticizing my channel size and views, which I find utterly fucking ironic. So much swearing, sorry, that's not MC. a criticism. Just fucking leave if you don't like I'm, my I'm swearing. I'm sorry, MC Nemesis, who are you? You're some irre irrelevant bitch-ass rapper that nobody gives a fucking shit about? You make <laughs> rap music. Oh, oh, wow, you're so popular, MC Nemesis. You make Ooh. rap music. Did he actually nobody say gives that? a fuck. Did he actually say that? No I, no, I found his channel. He makes rap music. Are you fucking kidding me? Bro, and you're on my channel? Get the fuck off my fucking channel, you <laughs> pathetic little shit. <laughs> I mean, my fucking god. Do I care? It no. Get the fuck out of here. If you don't like my stream, dislike. And leave. And during all this, he tried spinning it as if we couldn't take any criticism. But I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty funny watching him spurg in my chat and try calling us out somehow. And this eventually escalated to the point where he wanted to square up with us, so we managed to convince him to join my Discord server to see if he would actually join the call. Hey, hey MC Nemesis, good. you should join VC with us, bro. We should fight. Come in, come in, bro. Come on, man. You I should mean, join, you the can join the Discord server. We welcome you here. 
We welcome you here, bro. You can join the Discord server, bro. Let's like, square up cage match. All right, for... join the Discord server. Join VC, bitch. I mean, you're, we did offer for you to join VC, and I also don't understand why the fuck you even care. You're trying to flex your channel size and your views like I give a shit to begin with. I don't know who you are, nor do I care. I just, if you really want to join, join the fucking Discord. It's right there. Uh, hey, size. he's here. He's in He's in the chat. He's in the Discord server. I mean, if he joins VC, drag him in. Well, this is where the real shitstorm unfolded. I was still trying to cover the original topic of my stream at the time, so I was only periodically checking my Discord server on my phone. But watching the chaos that followed after MC Nemesis joined was both hilarious and sad. I will play what few clips I did catch during this, but to briefly explain what happened, MC Nemesis inevitably joined my server, but refused to actually join VC and talk to us. So everyone there who was active started demanding that he actually grow a pair and join VC. This, however, quickly just turned into everyone there bullying him. <laughs> My fucking Discord is bullying this man, holy shit. <laughs> I might as well hop in here so he assumes he's gonna be on stream. I was waiting to see if he'd hop in. <laughs> nah, we're just chewing him out. No one cares about your irrelevant Irrelevant ass. level. Alright, well, MC video. Nemesis, oh, since you're so relevant, I'm gonna go back to watching Tomboy, my lol cow bitch now, because you're a pussy-ass little motherfucker that won't square up in VC. Bye! And to no one's surprise, he refused to join the call, and continued having a hissy fit in my server. Now, I obviously got bored of this and went back to resume my stream very quickly, but for the next, like, 20-ish minutes, everyone active in my server was trying to bully him into joining VC. I mean, it was actually getting pretty toxic, although it was pretty funny at the time, and I was still periodically checking this all on my phone. Uh... Tell you... Fuck, I don't care. But, this eventually got to the point where I had to step back in, because he was refusing to actually talk to us, and was only causing a toxic shitstorm in my server. But, I think this was honestly one of the funnier parts of my interaction with him, because, well... I banned the little fucker. Join VC, or I'm banning you. All right, he's getting banned. <laughs> I love you too, Nier. <laughs> yeah, like I said, MC, if you're not gonna man the fuck up, bye bye so I gave him an ultimatum, 10 seconds to actually man the fuck up and talk to us in VC, or I would ban him, which I ended up doing. From here, I pretty much ignored the entire topic of MC Nemesis for the rest of my stream, up until the last few minutes, because then I took a quick look at his quote-unquote channel. There you are. Oh, big boy subscribe. <laughs> What are these fucking views, bro? What are your views? <laughs> I get more views on my fucking streams. Bro, are you sure you don't want to be a lol cow too? Holy fuck. Relevant ass bitch. Who the fuck do you think you were coming into my goddamn fucking channel? <laughs> 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 Well, after this, I ended my stream, but little did any of us know at that point about the rabbit hole we were about to go down. See, we joked about making him a lol cow as well, after seeing how ridiculous he was. That is until Brother Nier dropped a link in my Discord server to a nearly hour-long YouTube video, which was already made exposing this MC Nemesis guy. This is where me and a few others decided to jump headfirst into this rabbit hole, and we watched the entire video in VC, which I'll leave a link to in the description, and I highly recommend that you watch it, because there's just so much wrong with this guy that I can barely even begin to touch on it here. 
In fact, the guy who made the original hour-long Exposed video did so almost three years ago. But after Brother Near made a community post sharing out the video and addressing the situation with him in my stream, would you take a guess who decided to show up after three whole years? Yeah, this insane little fucker Schmegmabites decided to come back and readdress all this drama after three years, just because of what happened during my stream, and because Nier shared his video. Again, I highly recommend everyone go and watch his video, link is in the description, because Schmegmabites himself will be readdressing all of this drama, as well as all of his archived evidence on multiple future streams, so I recommend checking out his channel for any future details. But, circling back to his actual video, I want to try and summarize some of it, as well as MC Nemesis, as best I can in my own video, before giving my closing thoughts. The best way I can summarize MC Nemesis, as well as his channel, is a completely unhinged fluke altogether. His existing quote-unquote rap channel has nearly 8,000 subscribers during the making of this video, while nearly all his videos, with a few exceptions, struggle to break even 1 to 200 views. He's basically the lol cow of the rap community, and he's managed to grow his channel through a very long history of toxic, manipulative behavior, both on YouTube and Discord. There's just way too much to unpack with how he's manipulative and what he actually does, so I'll try to show any screenshots I can get of his behavior as I go. But basically, MC Nemesis puts on a fake act and tries to act like he's playing some kind of 5D chess with his YouTube and on his Discord. To boil down his behavior, he pretends to be some crazy, like, villain on the internet when he's also pretending to preach some message of positivity on his channel. He's just a manipulative, toxic, clout-chasing retard who is just hiding his true colors through these behaviors, because again, it's all just an act. And if all that sounds confusing, well it is. But in my opinion, the gist of how this works is akin to someone like Young Defiant, or Blank, if you remember his irrelevant ass. They get clout through all this negativity, regardless of what's true and what is just an act or an outright lie. Like, he even goes as far as to flex his criminal record, both in his songs and in random conversations, as some kind of W or something that makes him cool. Long story short, this guy is unhinged, and all of his retarded behavior is just a means to get clout or manipulate people into getting what he does want. Like, this guy just needs fucking help, dude. I mean, for fuck's sakes, he made a fake e-girl to help promote his channel and his image. A fake e-girl. That was allegedly his girlfriend. Aaron strives for popularity amongst everything else on this platform, and with this mentality, he will do everything in his power to make himself look attractive to an audience. With that being said, sometimes it can look very desperate. Aaron has a reputation on YouTube for using extremely noticeable duplicate accounts of himself, basically jerking his own dick off in the comments. 80% of the time, they are completely noticeable, as they are accounts that don't have any activity on their actual home pages or any linked videos. Aaron even went as far as to use a fake e-girl. To do what I can only imagine is to seem attractive or prove that he is attractive. I have so many questions! Again, I'm sourcing all of this from the exposed video in the description. It's the last time I'll mention it, but I highly recommend everyone go check it out if you're more interested in learning about this guy. And it's a much better alternative than going to his actual channel and giving him or his videos any engagement, because that's exactly what he wants. See, despite how smart he thinks he is, I know he wanted me to talk about him, whether it was a video, live stream, etc. That's why he came into my stream and Discord to begin with. Because he wanted to gain clout through me by doing exactly this. And, well, I know I'm still kind of feeding into that with this video, but that's what this section is for. Because giving this guy any kind of engagement is exactly what he wants. So, I just want to reiterate, please don't go to his actual channel and give him that engagement. I hope my video and the one linked in the description will be enough to quench you all. And last time I'll say it, but check out Schmegmabite's channel as well for future updates and details if you're really that interested in learning more about MC Nemesis. But with all that being said, I think that's going to do it for my video on this topic. I know it was short and mostly just me rambling, but I didn't want this to go on too long, and this is already a bit out of the ordinary on my channel anyway. But this was still some fun drama that I wanted to cover nonetheless. And what baffles me the most about it all is why this guy chose my channel and my stream at the time to begin with. Like, just... <laughs>
Why me? It's just so confusing, but also pretty funny. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this unconventional rant of mine, covering my interactions with this specimen, the lol cow of the rap community that is, MC Nemesis. So, big ups for watching, and especially if you made it this far into the video, y'all are the real ones, and I really appreciate the hell out of you guys. And, you know, maybe subscribe for some more quality therapy, and I'll catch y'all in the next video.